From the YouTube Dome Show, this is Week of the Daily Ruler, and now, the man who is to YouTube as Ken Thompson is to anything. Yeah, right. Ellie Cunny Ruler! Ha! Welcome to Week of the Update. I'm Ellie Cunny Ruler. What is up, my guys? Help us. Okay, tonight's Cast Light winners are Spider Bros. the fan edits and things like that. We can go to the streams. And once again, Fnatic, Cartwheel Snack, and Supercar Fnatic with all things automobile. Okay, automobiles, trucks, and whatever. Alright? Yes, indeed. I gotta tell you something, alright? We're gonna have too much fun tonight. And we're gonna have just enough fun. Who knows? Yo! Adam! It's time! Alright. We are uh, cleaning out the tubes. Just get turned into the driveway. We are now into your homes. Let's get busy! We're talking about Keenan Thompson tonight. Listen to this, right? He's doing all that. Saturday Night Live, Ring the Funny, and New Show and Power to Keenan. But here's the thing, right? Not a lot of people know this. Alright, that Keenan Thompson has been uh, losing weight lately. You wanna know how he's been doing it? Veggie burgers and uh, exercise. Veggie burgers. Wow. Yeah, but uh, wait a minute. Aren't the uh, veggie burgers uh, just the same thing as regular burgers, except for uh, the fact that they have replaced meat with uh, vegetables? Yeah, probably. Anyway, he said that he will stay on Saturday Night Live as long as he can stay on NBC. Hmm, really? What will NBC say? I mean, the network has been known for having a lot of uh, so-called stars lately. So, yeah. Of course, you know, whenever I do this, you know, around the world, you know, uh, that means that uh, they're not really stars. You don't say. You just did. These aren't four, four, four-year-olds. They're nine-year-olds. And if you didn't get that, then you'll get the top eight. Yeah, let's hope for uh, that they'll get the top eight list. Let's hope. Top eight rejected Kenyon Bomson Barrington. Number eight, Clip Boy. Number seven, his fucking stupid fish guts. Number six, Monkey Stork. Number five, Jumping Jack. Ah ah ah, stupid. Number four, Hopping Hurry. Number three, K-Town. Number two, Clip Craig, Cryptic Craig. Number one, Stewie Pie. But number zero, The Good Burger. I rest my case. We'll be back after this. We got these the commercials and I'll go find the night whatever. Captain Steve was coming up. Okay, when are you going to do something about that old carpet? I mean, here it is coming up on the holidays. How can you let it go any longer? No excuse for that, especially when Empire's prices start so low. I mean, $7.95 yard installed with padding? And hey, when you call us, your carpet comes next day. Plenty of time for the holidays. But listen, your first payment doesn't come until next spring. 588 300 Empire. So come on, call your carpet guy. Me. Show. 
and fitness, you know? You know what? Uh, in all the years that we have done this uh, show, we have never, ever, you know, had uh, a sketch that was, that was more eccentric, more daring, and more ironic than Captain Steamer. And tonight, we have another Captain Steamer sketch uh, on board for you folks, and let's see how uh, this one will work. This is Captain Schemer, recording 32. I am Captain Schemer. Oh, come on, not again. I know, this is getting pretty annoying, isn't it? <sighs> Anyways, I'm just thinking about how Keenan Thompson was able to be on SNL, executive produced the new All That Show with his buddy Kel Mitchell, do the first season of his new show, The Keenan Show, and be a judge on NBC's Bring the Funny all at once. If only Derek McCormick can do something like that in the near future. What do you think? Yeah, if only he could. Because that's how awesome he is. I mean, isn't that incredible? Uh, well, maybe he's trying to be like Steve Harvey, I guess. True, but Keaton hasn't been able to host a talk show yet. True, and Keaton Thompson was practically the only person who could be on TV and still find time to fix the lights. True, but let's just go back to week nine update. Maybe the lights will come back on soon, I hope. But you know what? Let's dance. In the dark. Oh, you've read my mind, interviewer. Back to you, Kong. <laughs> well, that was something. Still didn't pay your 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 your, your electricity bill, huh? Now, look at this, alright? Now, the people at OK Magazine, uh, you know, uh, have really dropped the bar in terms of uh, stories. You know, because, because now what they're talking about is Thompson uh, sharing his weight loss secrets. First of all, don't be lazy. Step one done. Now, step, step two. Die in X. Step three and four, profit and drop. Look at this, alright? He says that he credits uh, eating a lot of the vegan friendly uh, impossible meat and uh, Beyond Burger. Of course you do, because of the good meat. Isn't it? No, uh, Good Burger got sketched a sketch on uh, all of that, which became a movie. But. Actually, it, he did cut out a lot of soda. It was a movie, and then it became a sketch. No, it was a sketch for a stand movie. Then go on. Okay, now. He said cutting out sugar was a big one, too, but he said that he drank a lot of soda growing up. Alright. No, that makes sense. And then he did full body old school workouts. You know what? Uh, laughing about the push ups and, uh, and the sit ups that he does to keep in shape. See? You can't be lazy. Just do work. Step one, done. Step two. Then he joked about uh, chasing around his kids. No, uh, he has two kids. One uh, who is one year old, and the other one who is five. So. Okay. I'm thinking, wait a minute. Have we dropped the ball in terms of uh, finding uh, stories uh, Why jokes about? Quite possibly, yes. Yes, yes, yeah. We're trying to make a, a show about lo about losing weight. Nani, Ganani, go on. Now, here's the thing, right? You know, uh, Ken Thompson has finally landed his own uh, show, right? NBC last month, uh, actually two months ago, I uh, gave a series order to the Keenan Show, which stars Keenan Thompson as a super dad and Andy Garcia as his father-in-law, right? A lot of people thought that would be the end of uh, his run on Saturday Night Live, but he insisted that he isn't going anywhere. But here's the thing, right? He's already uh, returning to Nickelodeon to be the executive producer of all that. And he's also serving as a judge on NBC's new reality competition show, Bring the Funny. Okay. All that, SNL, Bring the Funny, Keenan Show, that's four shows right there! He's making money. He's doing what he was born to do. Yeah, but I'm thinking 
thinking that he's starting to uh, turn himself into Steve Harvey. So what? Steve is rich, so 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 he can be too. Now he said that uh, it's the dream. Uh, it's every comedian's dream to get their own show on a major network, especially one of the original three. And I'm like, uh, well, well, first off, you know, uh, that's kind of uh, what the dream is for this show, right? You know, to get this show on uh, the big. Like uh, he said, it's every comedian's uh, dream. So ha. Huh. Now he said it's historic, mind blowing, and very surreal. But it takes a lot of work. We shot the pilot. It was a, it was like a seven day shoot, and in the middle of that, I was doing Saturday Night Live. I was doing SNL. It's a lot of work. It's going to be an uphill battle as far as figuring out what's working and what's not working on an audience. But that's an advantage that SNL has. An audience can will tell you pretty quickly if the joke works or not. When you're shooting a show and tape, you got to believe your instincts. So it's a very different process. Yeah, true. So. So basically, he's doing the work that, that he has to do to get good. And I say, Buddha, you do you do the best that you can do. Do your best, and you, and you might succeed. Yeah. What? Yeah, but expect ex, 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 something to say some some else. No. no Wait a minute, Adam. He was. So you know what, like he did all that, right, in the 90s. He did, uh, but he did Keenan and Kel. No, the Kel Mitchell. He's, uh, exec, you know, he's on, uh, he was on Saturday Night Live for a number of years. No, still is. You know, uh, and now he has his own uh, TV show. So, I guess what we're trying to say is, uh, to all you kids out there, if you want to have your own uh, show on a major TV network, First thing you gotta do is audition to be on all that. The first thing that you have to do is be funny, or you know, just be just be you and uh, and just keep on going like that, you know. Yeah. Or you can do what uh, what I did when I turned 13 years old and start uh, a YouTube show. Yeah. Well, you ain't ex exactly famous yet. Ah. Uh, Ten years uh, on YouTube, that's uh, famous enough, isn't it? And uh, besides, I'm not doing this I'm not doing this for the fame. I'm doing this for all you folks uh, at home. And to get on late night television. That is the truth. Now, uh, thank you for uh, tuning into the uh, show tonight. You know, I really appreciate it. Oh, by the way, you know, uh, you know before I forget, you know what? Uh, if you have any ideas on how I can uh, make my thumbnails better, you know, well, comment down below, all right? You know, because, you know, I, I'm not always, uh, you know, I'm always uh, doing the show. I never really thought about how to make the, uh, the thumbnails uh, great, you know, uh, in terms of the, uh, the text and everything else. So, please uh, help me out with that. Please. Do not, uh, you know, uh, give me any uh, mean uh, clickbait uh, stuff, okay? You know, give me some uh, ideas, all right? Anyway, thank you so much for being here. I'll see you all tomorrow. That's news. No outskies. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.